A rallying cry for New York Democrats to get on the momentum train and help Kamala Harris defeat Donald Trump in the race for the White House. We have a career prosecutor against a career criminal. Okay, I just want to make that clear. We have someone who fights for women and someone who abuses women. Governor Kathy Hochul among the top Democrats who attended the gathering Wednesday night organized by Harlem to the Heights campaign committee. The audience included state delegates, union leaders and everyday voters like Karen Moreno, a retired member of the NYPD. Very important. It's, we're in a very precarious position right now. I, I'm first time in my life ever that I can say I'm fearful for where America is right now. Pro-Palestinian demonstrators lined the outside of the venue and some even made their way inside, one interrupting when Mayor Eric Adams started to talk. The beauty is, is that even when you have the naysayers, oh, make sure you vote, make sure you vote, tell them to vote. Former City Council Speaker Melissa Mark Viverito said it's important for local Democrats to get out the vote. People can do phone banking, people can call their relatives and friends in other states, but also we do need to grow the electorate. We need to get more people registered to vote. Selena Gray, who is a New York State delegate, says this event is just the beginning with the Harris Walls excitement building straight into the Democratic National Convention. From people not wanting to go to convention <laughs> to now people trying to get tickets to get into the convention. I had a, we were on a call the other night and they said that tickets are like people are selling the tickets on the black market for up to $5,000 for the convention. 